What's up dudes and dudettes? I'm sorry I'm a little disheveled this morning, but I just woke up and I happened to find out that I had more residuals. I already opened it, I apologize, because uh, I, I wanted to see if it was what I thought it was, and it is. This is the very first residual check I've gotten from Netflix. Now, for those of you who are new to the channel, my name is Adam. Uh, I'm a comedian and an actor. I was also in uh, the number one movie on Netflix last year called Hillbilly Elegy. And I only had one scene, but it was a good scene. If you've seen the movie, I'm the dude in the radio shack that yelled at the kid for stealing the calculator. Now, that being said, I've always been curious what the residuals going to be like for Netflix. I know what residuals are like from a network like Fox, but uh, Netflix has their own residual agreement with SAG, so uh, I know it's going to be different. So you can see here, I don't know if you can read that, Netflix, SAG payment. Let's get right into it. Why, why waste time? So you can see Internet Rental, Hillbilly Elegy. For those of you who have no idea, Hillbilly Elegy is a Ron Howard movie starring Glenn Close and Amy Adams. It was up for two Oscars. It was up for um, Best Supporting Actress for Glenn Close and Best Hair and Makeup. <laughs> uh, I can't get over the fact that this is Oscar nominated hair, man. So how much is the amount? $509.80. So how much is the check exactly? $324.80. There you go. That is my first residual check. So they took out, uh, looks like they just got a bunch of money for taxes. But there you go. $329.33 that I was not expecting to get in the mail. And it just showed up. It's the beauty of acting, man. So, hell yeah. So there you have it. A residual check from Netflix. Hope you guys dig it. If you did, click the like button, subscribe, all that jazz, and I'll catch you guys next video. By the way, I know I'm uploading this a little out of order, but I've got a lot of stuff that I filmed on my travels, you know, when I was opening for Nick DiPaolo and, uh, you know, just going through South Florida. I'll edit those and put them up, but I've just been so busy with auditions and stuff lately that I haven't gotten to it. For that, I apologize, but they are coming. I'll chat with you guys later. Love it.